EcoFlow power kits offer four ways to charge your batteries. Solar, your RV alternator, shore power, and the smart generator. Before you purchase solar panels, first assess the roof space on your RV or off-grid build and determine how many panels you can fit by checking the dimensions of your chosen solar panels. The Power Hub supports up to 4,800 watts solar input, with three dedicated ports, each allowing up to 1,600 watts input for solar or your alternator. Here, EcoFlow's portable solar panels designed for power kits are a good match, as they're durable and rugged for outdoor use. If you're an RV user, it's best to plug all your panels into one of the dedicated solar ports, since they aren't likely to exceed to 1600 watts. This way, you can free up the other dedicated port for portable solar panels, and the alternator port for alternator charging. If you're building for off-grid, you can spread the panel's input across the three ports to ensure even charging in the event that some of your panels are shaded. The alternator charging port on the Power Hub is supported by a convertible DC to DC battery charger with an MPPT module, which can support either alternator charging or solar charging. Here, we will explain how to use vehicle alternator charging. If you're an RV user, Connect your vehicle starter battery to the power hub to enable alternator charging using the included cable. First, connect the positive of the cable to your vehicle starter battery's positive. Then, connect the negative of the cable to the vehicle chassis. On the power hub, the second port from the right is the AC charging port. If you're an RV user, this port is ideal for shore power charging. Your power kit includes a dedicated AC charging cable for this purpose. Simply connect the L, N, and PE wires of the cable to 30 amp RV shore power inlet to charge. If you're off grid, you can also use this port as a way to charge your batteries via other AC methods, such as a generator or bi directional charging from your electric vehicle. In extreme cases, you can use the EcoFlow Smart Generator as a backup power source. To set up your Smart Generator, turn the fuel cap vent lever and engine switch to the ON mode. Then, connect it to your power hub via the extra battery port with the EcoFlow Smart Generator adapter. You can also start charging the power kit system right away by pressing and holding the electric start button remotely from the EcoFlow app or manually with the starter grip. That's a look at the main ways to charge your LFP batteries in your power kit. Need more tutorials? Head to the EcoFlow Support YouTube channel for more.